Hi everyone, welcome back to The Elusive Panda. Today, we're going to frame some very large canvas prints. I have three of them, and they are three feet by four feet. We're gonna wrap those on canvas stretcher bars. Let me show you what one of these looks like. The first thing I need to do is trim the excess edges of the paper, which will bring it down to exactly the right size for our canvas stretcher bars. When I printed the paper, I put a small black border all the way around, and I can use that as a guide when I put it on the rotary trimmer. Next, I'm going to assemble the frame which is made up of these stretcher bar pieces right here, two 36 inch and two 46 inch pieces. These will go together in the corners. Sometimes you have to hammer them together a little bit. Okay. I've put the print down on a soft foam surface face down, and then I'm gonna take the frame lay it on top of the print, get it nice and square, laid out evenly all around, and then I can fold the print over and I'll start stapling it to the back of the frame. The corners have to be tucked in. It's a little bit tricky, but I basically fold it in and make two folds over like this. It's kind of tough work pulling the canvas really tight and it really wears out your hands and your fingers because you want it to be wrapped as tightly as you can around the frame so there's no sagging or ripples. So I think I've got it pretty well, but because this canvas is so large, I'm gonna add these corner spacers. So these little wooden pieces, insert in each corner and you drive them in with a hammer. And what that does is it takes the corner joint and it causes the corner joint to expand a little bit. And that will make the canvas really nice and tight and flat across the entire frame. The last step after putting corner spacers in all four corners would be to put on the hanging hardware of your choice. That could be a sawtooth bracket or maybe you prefer hanging with wire. That's easy to do and I'll add that later. But let's take a look at the finished canvas wrap. Hey, looks good, right? If you have any questions about the canvas wrapping process, or if you'd like to know more about large format printing in general, just uh, put a comment down below. And I hope you'll subscribe to my channel. Keep an eye out for more videos, and I'll see you next time.